stupid people and all their talent. Carla and Brendan here from Games, Brains and Headbanging Live, gbhbl.com for sure. And it's reaction time as I am going to throw something Brendan's way for fun um, that I know he's not probably listened to, but turned out to be one of my more surprising album of the year contenders. It is Binary Order, a solo band by Benjamin Blank, combining elements of metal, atmosphere, synth, rock, acoustic. It's incredibly strong music new album messages from the deep was released on november 29th 2022 i picked this up for review on the basis that i put it on and if it grabbed me i'd write something if not i'd probably just leave it um you know too busy sometimes to pick up everything it's like well and did this grab me it grabbed me so much i gave it 10 out of 10 and absolutely fell fucking in love with it. So I kind of wanted to do a track from it for a reaction video. And I was like, well, we're not going to get a video. We're going to get the music. And what can I choose? Which one from this incredible album can I pick? So I've gone for Stillwater, which comes at the latter part of the album. Um, yeah, I, I can't. I don't want to describe it. I don't want to go into detail because that's the point of direction. going to hear it. Brendan's going to get yeah. an idea. And then maybe he'll love it. Maybe he'll hate it. I don't know. But either way, uh, I'm interested to see what he thinks. I'm going to take it you're not aware. Not aware. No, I know nothing. Never heard Which... of them. Don't think so anyway. No, I definitely haven't. Which is perfect, Jon Snow. That's exactly how we like it. That way it is, at least on Brendan's front, completely and utterly brand new. Um, all right, let's do this. It's by new order, still water. Taken from the album Messages from the Deep. Available now. Go pick it up. Check it out. It's well worth it. Three. Two, one, go. Time is upon a 
stupid people and all the talent. People get like <laughs> more talent in one fucking finger than, you know. Yeah. What do you think? Uh all right. I liked it. So I'll start with that. That's an yep. easy one. I liked it. <laughs> um I liked his voice. I felt like there was the only bits I like I was a bit like, oh, uh, I felt like the ending kind of 30 seconds or so it was like it was stretching. It was like, all right, all right, come on, wrap it up, wrap it up, mm-hmm. you know, a little bit. Um, we had a nice voice, had a nice kind of ambient feel to a lot of the song, you know, quite atmospheric, I guess, a little bit yeah. um, as well, but, you know, very listenable. Um, probably would have been turned off it a little bit if it had gone that way throughout the whole song. So the little switch ups, the slight transitions into, you know, a bit more of a growly, sort of shout and then a heavier beat for a little bit was very very welcome at that point it came at a good time really probably the perfect time it was like i'm still enjoying i'm still enjoying it don't get me wrong but i feel like if that hadn't have come then i might have been like oh, okay right i was quite confused at first because i was reading along with the lyrics right and the lyrics are good i like the lyrics um uh but i was also aware that i'd finished all the lyrics and uh it was like two minutes in so I'm like, <laughs> okay he's either going to repeat everything again or what's, what, what are we going to do now <laughs> You know, uh, and obviously there's, there's there is a bit of repetition, I guess, of the chorus of sorts. It's not massively traditional in terms of like sort of choruses. It's not really like verse, chorus, verse, chorus, but mm. you know, but um, it's still, I guess, the repeated bit is the chorus. Uh, so yeah, look, I like it. I think he's got a nice voice, got some good sounds in it. I like the ambient side of it. I thought it was quite chill. I like the little switch up. Just gives it a little bit more. Gives it that little something special to go. Okay, that's what makes turns it from. Oh, that's an okay song until oh yeah that's a good song you know so yeah yeah it's good it's interesting i've never heard of them at all heard nothing about it something about water still water message from the deep so there's a water theme going on well it is um it is i think like track nine of the album or at least in the latter end of it as well i uh, i will stick uh not stick up because not that you slam the but that uh, that sort of transition at the end is because it's going to transition into another track mm. that's kind of you kind of have that's why it cuts like at 4, 4, 4, 35, 5, 35 as well. It's like dead stop there. That aspect. That's a major part of the album. In fact, it's one of those weird ones where I knew, and this has happened, I think, with Dan's like done a video with me as well, where it's like, I'm going to play you something, but I'm kind of like, go listen to the full fucking album because mm. it's part of a bigger Pete. It's that thing that I feel like will sell it more than anything else. But that's a big ask of a person. Go listen to a full album when you've got X amount of other music to do, especially yourself. When you're listening to music all the time, it's a big ask. It's not so much that. You know, my love for this track um, and the album overall, like I said, it's, 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 I was trying to find one that I felt A, wouldn't be too long as well, because there are some longer, longer pieces of music on it, but I felt like really got across the elements that I really like, which is atmosphere and ambience amongst a mixture of melodramatic drama stuff and um, the heavier kind of side that comes out as well and how that transitions quite nicely. I thought it would work perfectly for that um i am a huge fan of this track i'm a huge fan of the album as i said at the start so there's no real like there's no really like debate on that part or like me gonna go oh yeah you made some good points in which you did because obviously as well the fact that you like it which is good enough because i was mm. a bit more naturally like, i can be a bit worried like ah you're maybe not as hot on say ambience in music as i am no and if it if no i'm not definitely not and if um if it had been like that the whole way through i don't know if i would have come out of it in the same but because mm. it has a, a, it doesn't have to be much but it has a little moment where it gives you like a it's not a breather because in a way it's, it's almost like the reverse of a breather isn't it it's almost like a, a little adrenaline shot like yeah you know what i mean and then then when it settles back in again i'm okay again uh, and, and that makes a difference because like it, it adds excitement to the track like do you know what i mean it doesn't I, I would struggle with a five and a half minute long song that was pure ambient sounds and melodramatic melody you know Mm -hmm. but there's enough in that structure enough in the lyrics and enough in those little moments to make it make me when i came at the end of it i didn't classify it then in my head as like oh that was an ambient track anymore like you know what i mean like it yep so well your opinion was the one that mattered in this because i'd already stated mine at the start so it's interesting to see all the elements you got from it as well um i am always worried about that i said the amount of drone 
drone tracks I put to the side because I'm like, well, that's going to be a nightmare. <laughs> He's going to hate every minute of that. Uh, has been quite a few. This is by New Order Still Water. It's an amazing track uh, from my perspective, a good track from Brendan's. There's a full album out very, very recently, 29th of November at the time of recording. So you should go check that out. Messages from the deep. Give this guy, give this artist a some love. Well deserved. Let us know what you think in the comments. Thank you very much for watching. If you liked what you saw, please help us out by giving us a thumbs up and hitting that subscribe button. If you really liked what you saw, consider donating to keep the website and channel running by buying us a coffee via our coffee page or picking up some merch from our big cartel store. You can check us out on gbhbell.com as well as via our social media, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, as well as listen to our interviews via SoundCloud, Apple Music, and Spotify. Just search for GBHBL. Games, horror, and heavy metal. What else is life for?